Sharia is off today. A seven year old Coleraine Township boy recovering tonight from a gunshot wound to the back. Coleraine police say that this boy was shot in the backyard of his grandparents' home while playing with his brother. WLWT News 5's Emily Wood live right now at Children's Hospital with the latest. Emily. Mike, the hospital says it cannot release any information about that young boy. Coleraine Township Police say, though, he was taken here last night for surgery and N is doing okay, but there's still a lot of unanswered questions as to why that gun was in the backyard and exactly how it was fired. Do you know where the gun is? I have no idea what's happened. I don't know what happened. I went out there with him. Parents in this Coleraine Township neighborhood want to know more about the gun, police say, ended up in this fenced in backyard. As soon as the pop was heard, the kids started screaming, Help me, help me, help me. And we're all, Mom, Mom, help me, whatever. And we're all like, What's going on? And then he comes running around the side and then into the house. Across the street, mother of two, Shauna Livering, can't understand how it even happened. I want to know where the gun came from. You know, why it was even outside, you know, just basically how a kid found a gun. You know, he could have brought it from out of the house. Who knows? They had come by the fence and look over here, seeing the other kids playing. Michael Starks lives behind the backyard where police say the gun was found. He says the boy's grandfather liked them staying close to home. They just pretty much playing in their backyard. They don't even really come over and play out here with the other kids. They pretty much keep to themselves, it seemed like, anyway. He just don't want to play with other children. It's sad. Coleraine police say it was an accidental shooting, and it's prompted parents to have a serious conversation with their kids about gun safety. I don't care if you see a gun outside, you do not pick it up. You come get me, and I will come and see what's going on with it, but do not ever pick up a gun. Now, in addition to Coleraine Township Police's investigation, Hamilton County Job and Family Services has also been notified about this case and will also conduct its own investigation. Reporting live tonight at Cincinnati Children's Hospital, Emily Wood, WLWT News 5. All right, Emily, thank you. Neighbors also said the grandparents have lived in the home with those two boys for the last three or four years.